drive. Come on, drive it, drive, 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 drive. Come on, more, 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 more. Right Shit. here, here. Ugh. Hold it, hold it, hold. Don't let it drive you back. Tiff, come on, come on, come on. Beautiful. Holy shit. What is up everybody? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today is Saturday, October 1st. Oh, hi Ruth. Hi baby. <laughs> She's like, I'm stealing the show. The show is hers. Um, oh, I love this puppy so much. So, okay. Hi. <laughs> so yeah, Saturday, October 1st. I'm actually waiting on Tiffany today. Um, I met this girl wonderful human being at the seminar that we've been in Tampa with uh, Joe Bennett and Tom Purvis and we met and we just get along Aquarius gang gang she's a wellness um, she's now a pro and she is just straight up badass so obviously I had to get a workout in with her since her and Terrence uh, her husband Mr. Ruffin, that you guys probably know him, or you should know about him now. Um, anyway, they're here in town um, to train, so I'm gonna train some glutes and hamstring, yes. So, waiting on her, um, I already ate my meal number one, which was turkey today, because I didn't get egg whites. So, I got here, I had my mega fit meal, just have those uh, a la carte meal, where I measure straight up from you know the pot four ounces eat that and then that's it so i'm gonna have a celsius during my workout today and i'm going to have for intra and pre-workout just my raw eaas um that's the red slushy that's honestly the only one that i'm taking because it tastes so good and i'm obsessed with it i normally get some ice in the morning but today i don't have any and today i'm Gonna, I'm gonna try the Peak O2. So I haven't tried this formula yet. yet. I only had the pump, which is uh, the steam free. But apparently this one is like just a different formula and just hits completely different. So I'm gonna try that, one scoop of that today. Um, I checked in with Kim yesterday and we spoke for a long, long time. And oh my God, the powder is actually brown. <laughs> oh well, okay. Um, and we spoke for over like an hour on the phone as always and just mm -hmm. try to understand when where I was standing at and just you know I'm me being me I'm just always worried of like losing muscles a lot um, and he reassured me that I shouldn't be worried about it and actually be careful with my leg development right now so more focus on building my upper glute um, my upper glute, to my waist, my waist extra tight. So, still gonna do only two leg workout a week, not three anymore, and uh, three upper body workout, and just focus on my back width. So that's the focus right now. Um, what else? Yeah, diet wise, we're gonna start some kind of a carb cycling situation where I'm going to be depleting myself three to four days a week. And then just have you know a food a major food bomb carb wise um, one day and then drop back down so that's gonna just help getting really things into motion we have like a solid solid 10 to 11 pounds to lose again to be in a place where we can just kind of cruise in and just have a more healthier diet when I say more healthier it's just like a more balance where like you have 20 30 percent 35 percent fats um a good amount of carbs to get you through the day and then say so amount of protein always stays the same throughout the prep i like having you know my eggs in the morning egg whites and then ground turkey i have i do have ground beef right now and that's what keeps me alive so right now what i've been doing with my ground beef i actually add an ounce of ground beef to each and every one of my meal um not each and every one but meal number two three and five two three and five and that just keeps me and my energy level like here not here but like right here so um that's what we've been doing i am also uh starting to take 
the Ignite again, which is the, the fat burner. So I took that in the morning and uh, that's about it. So I'm gonna put some water in there um, and we're gonna wait on Tiffany to get started. And I haven't done my cardio yet. I woke up this morning, I had three posing clients. So I'm gonna have to do 45 minutes of cardio because right now I'm staying up there in Stewart during the week and having clients over here at Iron. And obviously when I'm here, finger crossed, I can always get a workout with Aldo. So that's what we're doing today. And I'll catch you guys, I guess, at the end of this video, because I don't, I'm not sure we're gonna talk today. We'll see how it goes. So right there, into the belt, belt. Go, into the belt. Add belt, go. One, release the belt, don't release it. Two, three, don't lean back, forward, chest up. There you go, but use the belt, now your fucking hands, pussy. Squeeze, five, four, Three, two, one more. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. One, two, three, four. Plus an out of belt over there. Let's go. Six, seven, eight, nine, one more. Ten, good. Yeah. Are we over here? Got it? Yeah. So squeeze into the belt, but don't act up just yet. Two, 
three, four, five, six, Six, keep going. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Five more. Five, last set. Three, two, one more. Good. Yes. You can do it. Let's go. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One more. Ten. Good. more a little bit. There you go. Don't drive it. Just contract your glutes in the direction of the spot. Feel it right? Feel it nice? Seven. Seven. Three more. Three. Two. One more. Up. Good. Eight. Two more. Nine. One more. Up. Oh, God. 
Ten. Five more. Five. Four. Come on. What's wrong? Oh Two. Come on. One more. Drive it up. Come on. Come on. Playground it's thing. really is. It's like playground thing. I got like, used to this shit. Yeah, exactly. For me, this is where I used to work because these are my weak points. But for you, it's like all those like 150, that little like nut bounce at the top. Like you don't release anything. Like just, yeah. it's a different ball game. Like you literally reverse for me. You know what I'm saying? Because me, I started with that. No way, just doing those, you know. Get out of your head. Come on, drive it, drive, 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 drive. Come on, more, more. More, more, right Shit. here. Here, oh. hold it, hold it, hold. Don't let it drive you back. Uh, Tiff, come on. Really come on, come on. Beautiful. Yeah. Holy shit. Oh, my God. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I just wanted you to get out of there. <laughs> I was like, boom. <laughs> Keep going, keep going, keep going. 
keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Right there, hold it, hold it. And control. Don't that. Don't release it. Guide it back out. Pause. No. Everything all at once. Come on. Come on. Oh. Come on. Perfect breath. Come on. Oh, control. Stay with it. Stay with it. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. All at once, all at once, all at once. I'm following, I'm following, I'm following. Keep going, keep going. Come on. Right. Squeeze. More. Right there. Good. Two more. Come on, go with it. Come on. I'm with you. I'm with you. Those are wellness tools, Orly. I swear to God. But I have a so hell legs. So <laughs> So hell. <laughs> Grasshopper. <laughs> no way. They're not grasshopper legs. <laughs> It'll get She's them. She's crazy. She doesn't get see them. herself the way we see her, like her. I swear. That's true. Wait, stay right there. <laughs> this is so cute, I swear to God. Wait, nope. Now, aggressive ones. Go, go, go. One, yeah. two, three, oh. four, five, six. Come on, come on. Squeeze. Seven, eight, nine. Come on, come on, come on. One more, one more. Ten. Yeah. It's like you're cracking your knuckles inside your butt, right? You're feeling like you, yeah, that's exactly what it is. More, 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 more. In the middle, in the middle, yeah, yeah. down in the middle, collect it right underneath you, and then push it through that way into the middle of the street. Hard, 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 oh, hard, 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 hard. Now dig your knees into the pad. Dig your knees into the pad. Push your quads into the pad. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Squeeze hamstrings hard, 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 hard. Hold that. Squeeze your butt. Squeeze your butt more, more, more. And use that to guide yourself straight. Straight Make in line. Tall. Straight in line. Straight in line. Like Superman. Yes. There you go. Yup. Control the negative. There you go. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Now go again. Squeeze. Ah, it did it. Collect it. Collect it. Hard. 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 Squeeze. There you go. More, 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 more. There you go. And contract, but you're controlling yourself back out. Want to push it down more? Okay. Yeah? Don't let push. 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 Now squeeze from your butt. Go. Squeeze your ass. Come on. Squeeze, quads into the pad. Get your knees. Come on. Squeeze come into my head. Yes, go, go, go. Hard. Squeeze it. Collect it. And slowly start collecting from here. In the middle. More. I'm trying my best, I swear. Ooh, you. Okay, let me restart. Just focus. Just chill. Just chill, all right? Just chill. Uh-uh, go. You 
have it, just drive this down first. With this though, and then to the left. Here, middle part. Yes, down, okay. stack it on top of one another slowly. Your glutes, babe, your glutes. No, not from here. All this in the, this little area right there is where it's happening. That's where you want it originally. Let's start. I don't know what I'm trying. I really am. I know. Poker, poker in the middle of the book. See, I can rip it, and there you go, but continue yeah, that. Yeah, continue. Right Boom. Here. Squeeze from there. From Start there, yeah, 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 yeah. Go, Squeeze go, your go. finger. Right here. Down. No, down. From here. Keep pulling this. Well, yes! yes! There you go. <laughs> more. More, though. Now you're upper body. Right. More. Squeeze. Keep there you go. There, there you go. There you go. Keep pulling. Squeeze. <laughs> and then drive, you can drive your, yeah. Knees. 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 Quads. Squeeze your butthole. Hard. Hard. Keep this down. There you go. And then Check. use that contraction to guide yourself straight. All right, you guys, that's a wrap for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Like <laughs> Sponsored by Celsius. That's right. It's good. In part. Yeah. Partly. Yeah, partly. So that's. The amazing woman I was talking about in the intro of my video. Wow, really? I did. I oh, did. that's nice. But <laughs> you can present yourself. So I'm Tiffany. I recently competed um, as a wellness competitor, and I moved here. Um, no, 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 please, what? please, don't be humble right now. She turned pro her first show. I did turn pro. I won the overall two, which was expected. Actually. I'll be humble. Talk your shit. I am talking, come on, I, this is ah. me, this is authentic me, so this is how I am. Uh, and I was, I was supposed to do the pro show in uh, class championship, but I wasn't ready mentally and physically. I was very tired, um, and I'm the kind of person where, you know, when, when I prepare for a show, I make sure that I, I'm 100% ready. And I knew that I was ready for that amateur show. And, and I prepped for that show for like over three years. And you know, now I'm like, the, the goal is to go for the Pittsburgh Pro Show next year. I think it's on May. Yeah, so I have enough time to grow. And, I, and then I recently moved here, moved here with uh, Terrence and met this lovely woman. I love her. I'm rooting for her to win the Olympia. Yep, you're gonna hear me. You're gonna hear me screaming. <laughs> I get her. Uh, yeah. in, like all, in all languages. I want the French. In all languages the... Arabic, Arabic, French, English. <laughs> oh my god. I have to also learn the Bulgarian language. And Spanish now that you're in Florida, Spanish. by the way. Yeah, Spanish, yeah. yeah. Um, I mean, I'm definitely excited for you. I mean, you look crazy yeah. amazing. Uh, you have a mindset and a discipline that is really, really, really rare, rare into the sport. Like, I've, I've met so many people. Yeah. And I haven't trained with a lot of women, but. I know where people go into like those dark places and it's very special for me to share a training with a girl that's going to the same places that I'm going and like respecting obviously mm -hmm. like our art form and like everything. So Aquarius gang here for sure. Yep. <laughs> We're on the yeah, same like wait we but I really love having you here and I hope you had a good workout. It was your yeah, it, was awesome. it was like your f official like first iron leg like, day. Oh yeah. With my baby over here. That's my humble love of my life. <laughs> yep. It was awesome. Um, I, like, I can't believe it. it's been like over a year now we've been together. It's been over a year. I love you. Wow. Then we have a second Olympia together. Yeah. Third are you final. Are you ready? Are you oh ready my God. To, to see her? Look at him. He just, like, we were just, I was just telling him about the Arnold because they just opened the registration like today and it was like, Let's do it. And now he's talking about the yard all right now. I was like, wait, I thought like you needed a conversation, but no, we're just gonna make what? it happen. <laughs> okay, let's do it. So yeah, third Arnold and then second Olivia. I love you so much. Thank you for training us today. It was fun. There's a warm up. That's why she moved. Because she can't, she can't work out like this. She doesn't want to. No, not because she doesn't want to, because she can't. Not that she can't, but she's not allowed to. There you go, she's not allowed to. We'll say it that way, but no, it's great. If I do that, at least that is once a week, you know, 
but thank you for coming. I hope you're going to come down. Or, I mean, we can come up, but sure. I mean, before the Olympia, it's going to be hard, but you know, you're always welcome I can, here. I can make it. Yeah, you can definitely make it. And then we're going to go all the way to Pittsburgh. We're always here. That's home, you know? That's the, yeah, I hope you enjoy. Yeah, I did a lot. And I want to tell you something. I had this interesting conversation um, yesterday with a friend of mine. He's in Lebanon. And we were discussing, you know, what a win is. And a lot of people, you know, they think that because a lot of us, especially as competitors, we just want to be the best. We just want to win the title and that's what we aim for. And when we aim for that, we sometimes lose um, lose track of, you know, we, we stop acknowledging the small successes along the way. Mm -hmm. And I want to tell you that, okay, I'm sure that you're going to win the Olympia 23, that's for sure, 2023. But if you don't, that doesn't mean you're not a winner. Because for me, a winner is a person who can impact the audience in a way more than anyone else. So as so if you can give the audience something, whatever it is, I don't know, maybe it's something that like educational, maybe how to overcome adversity. This is my number one thing because a lot of women go through this, especially mm -hmm. back in my country in Lebanon, a lot of women go through this with their family or their relatives or whatever. Society, so, period. Society, yeah. yeah, especially but coming from an Arab background, you know, like it's, that, it's yeah. really hard. Yeah. And I've been through that, so I really think that, that's what I want to tell you, that you're already a winner, to be honest. You're gorgeous, you have it all. And I want to tell you this, I told Aldo yesterday that, you can ask him, I, I didn't shut up talking about you. <laughs> I kept saying that you're amazing, you're beautiful, and I want you to acknowledge that and see that and when you step on stage just consider yourself already there like a winner you know i mean because you really? are there thank you you're gonna make me cry i like yeah. can you just say your age because i get to just blow um. my mind <laughs> just blow my mind like yeah how, like where have you been all my life you oh know? my god yeah. we're gonna be best friends um yeah i'm 22 years old <laughs> Crazy. Her heart is so pure and that is so rare, but I just want to say so thank you. Old, and so I think, yeah. I think, um, you know, I always say that this sport has to make me happy. That's one. And then, obviously, a title doesn't, not that it doesn't mean anything to me, but it I'm not here like chasing exactly. it. And for me, when I won the Arnold, that was the first time I can like officially say I wasn't like, I won this mm -hmm. title. I was just within the journey, exactly. like, like really. Going to enjoying. My, so my when, truth. when they say enjoying the process, yeah. Well, I, I don't really. But she the felt process. like what I you like to said. kill myself and be like, you know, the more this is something about me where the more um, stressed I am, the closer I am to the win. I don't know why. It's something I like to put myself into torture for this. But um, sometimes it's nice to just step back and see the whole picture. You know, see it all and appreciate it. Appreciate it. Yeah. Yeah. And if you if you stay with your truth, like the fact that you're 22 years old, and like, I mean, you've already been through so much, and like you're just starting your career yeah. now, and sometimes you would think you would get very, it's easy to let the noise come into your ears, but you you like block that at such a young exactly. age to your family. Like I wasn't able yeah. to block that at yeah, first. I, I had to just I went and hide. Oh. But you just fucking faced I it did. every day I, and you had it inside, faced, inside your face every day. Oh, yes. And that's different. And that's like a big win in now itself because it can be America. so strong. Yeah. I mean, America yeah. she's just now you, her own. Now you're 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 going up against a real test. Yep. Now yeah. it's the American people that you have to fucking What do you mean? I it's lived. different. It's, it's, it's different over here. Like the, the the competing over here versus over there. The people here versus like the people. Like they're different, and right? I, I don't know. Like, what do you think about? I mean, might as well go deep because we're already deep yeah, into it. Yeah. What about like your relationship? Like, I don't know if you want to talk about it. Like, do you feel like that? You guys do you get like a you know, like noise, like annoying noise. Like, how do you deal with it? Because I mean, me and Aldo like. What do I don't do it spoke about this because being in a relationship, I don't know, you guys are in the same, it's like having the same boss, literally, and then I don't know how you deal at the house, like, do you deal with like, well, they're okay, both competitors like, too. 
I know, but is it going to be like, okay, yes, we're competitors, but we leave the badge outside, the, like, we leave the badge at work, and then we come back at the house, and then, like, how do you guys go with it? Like, is it a lifestyle. Or are you, like, always? We are always in sync as much as we can, yeah. We don't even have to, like, try, or it's, it's just there. Yeah. That's the thing. With me and Terrence, it's just there. Everything is just there, you know? I mean, we, Did you for sure, we always, like, you always have that maybe a few issues in there, but with us, it's like, more, like 90% of the relationship is fucking perfect. For me to move all the way from Cyprus to, 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 to America, just to leave everyone there and to move, yeah. it's, I'm, I, I'm convinced that this is the man for me. I'm looking at him while we're talking. Yeah. <laughs> he, just, he never gets scared, like ever. Like you know, With him, no. Good for you. I, with every guy before him, yes, and I was hesitant. And see, like you would never even move. With, like now, it's a big move that yeah. you're by yourself. Yeah. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. And like, I don't it know. I, I think that's awesome. I'm it excited is. for you. <laughs> it's just the beginning for you. You it know, like, just, and you're so far ahead. Yeah. Mentality, like just training wise, like that's why we're, I'm like. I feel that she's reverse of me. You know, like now I'm more. Like I need more of her intensity. <laughs> no, but you understand what I'm saying? Like. Like, I need no, more intensity, and she needs more, like, intentions. Yeah. She like, waited for city. You, you know, when we met, like, I was not even, like, 25. I was 25 on each side. We were, like, no, you're stronger than that. Like, you've been training for not seven right. years. I told him this story. Oh, really? Yeah. Like, for seven years, I trained with, like, and you you make me see my force, and now you make her see the intention of it. And she's really strong. But it's, like, now she has to dig those, like, little, yeah. those, like, yeah. deeper muscle. Like, and how I, do you, like, appreciate your strength? How you produce it and find it, go explore into the like explore it, the all in between, yeah, and own it. I, I mean, come back anytime, it's so fun. Of like course, it. of course, yeah. Thank you. You have the code <laughs> to the gym, so you're allowed to back here whenever you want, you know, where the lights are. I That's love right, it. yeah, you're, you're, you're very VIP, huh? VIP, <laughs> yeah, for sure. Uh, when I, when I, I guess, you know, because since we were talking about adversity. Um, and you know my mental strength, you know where I'm where I'm at now. So I started at the age of 16 training. It wasn't that serious at first, but at the age of 17, things at home were really messed up. And um, and I had to deal with this every day, whether it was my cooking, bothering everyone. Every time I would cook, everyone would just critique that. They would criticize that. My mother hated my. Um, I'm not saying that she's a bad person. I'm not saying that my parents are bad, bad people or anything. It's a misunderstanding that was Misunderstanding spoken and of. also you cannot really convince um, someone to see it the way you see it. So everyone has their own way of seeing things. It's like maybe my mom enjoys something that I don't see why she enjoys that. But, it, uh, but regardless, I still, I knew I wanted to do this and I kept going. And I, had, I have this character where I'm so fucking stubborn when I want something and when I see my potential in that, that's very important. Seeing your potential all the way and visualizing it because not everyone, again, not everyone is, me like, you're, not everyone's meant for the sport. Mm -hmm. To be honest, a lot of people think, you know, I wanna go all the way, but you're not meant for the sport. I'm being very honest here. So you have to find yourself in that thing that you, you're good at and that you want to do in life, both at the same time, and just go all the way. And at the end of the, at the end of the day, your parents are going to support you, even though they don't like it. Eventually, they're gonna see it the way you see it. Do you feel that so, was like at some point? I feel like you can fuel your fire now by yourself, but do you feel that that thing at the house was like? Pushing you even more to just be like, I'm gonna show you. Yeah, but I. But you know, but, you but know, you're not lazy here either, because no. I was like, you could, could you like understand what I'm trying to say? Like, yeah. you could come here and like start being kind of like lazy yeah. because you don't have the same adversity to face every single day that was driving you. But you find another drive. drive. Yeah. Yeah, I still have that drive. What, where do you think it, it's coming from now? It's just a different. It's like I now because my parents they look at me and they're like, that's what they told me. I remember. The day I won my show, my mother cried and she said, is this my daughter? Did she really do this? 
And I remember my father took me aside and he also said, I'm so proud of you. I can't believe that after everything we have been through together, you did this. So they saw it eventually, they saw it. Um, and now it, I feel like I want to show them more. So there, it's, it's, like, it's like a greater drive. It's like, and it's not, you know what, before it was more like, I want to prove it to myself more than I wanted to prove it to them. I wanted to prove to myself that every decision I made in life was correct. Mm -hmm. Because I left all my friends, my family, my, even my exes for this because no one would understand why I did what I did. They would criticize it all the time. But I, I just, I wanted it so bad. I really wanted it so bad. And I told them, watch me. I went was for my your, first show. Was that your answer like to them? Like, what, what, yeah. What, yeah, I was like, me? just watch me. I literally, I told them, just watch me win my first show. I'm gonna win it. I'm gonna win the overall. I'm aiming for my pro card and the overall. And I did it. I did it from Amazing. first, uh, as a first timer, I did it because I took my time. I didn't, you know, a lot of people, they're like, let's go, let's, like, they prep for a year, they're like, I want to go for a show. When do you think I can compete? When do you think, no, take your time. Yes. Take your time. You, what's, what's the rush? I think that's, you know? that's, that's the saddest part into bodybuilding, which is like, I love that there's so much eager into jumping in, but people are like, I'm gonna be at the Olympia, but it's like, no, 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 but like, take a deep breath. Like, I love that you have goals, but enjoy the journey. Stay in there yeah. for a little bit. Like, stay in there for a while, like, enjoy. Like, you did three years. You were probably, like, yeah. I swear to God, you were probably, like, ready to go on a pro stage your first year and probably, like, I was. And, and win. But you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but guess why I didn't? Because I told myself, when I step on that stage, I want the judges to be like, on the that's her. Yeah. Like, like, like everybody's no, second. Like, who's yeah, second? that's her. She's winning. I don't want to leave them in doubt. You know, I want yeah. this, yeah. and that's my, my the, the way I like for my for, for my pro show. This is what I want too. I want it for every show. Every time I step on stage, this is what I want. I want no. She she's meant for the pro show. I'm not meant for it right now. The the pro stage right now. I I think I can do more, I, and I want to take my time. And I think another year is gonna get me ready for like you know for my pro pro yeah. show. So I'm real, I'm, I'm real, and I'm honest with myself. If there's something that I'm lacking, I'm gonna take a step back and work on it. And um, and it's important that along the way you learn, you meet people that are also that can help you learn. So you know, I read this quote from Jordan Peterson. I don't know if you know. Yeah. He says expect that the person you're talking to knows something that you might not because there are a lot of people they think they know everything but you really never know you're always going to learn from someone something so don't expect that person to be don't underestimate anyone you, you never know you might learn something yeah right. I mean I learned I learned today a lot and, and you keep learning and I think having an open mind to any and everything it makes the journey so so much better so much. so much better people are you know I get I get the fact that like if you get you need to get locked down into a prep and like focus but not close your mind to anything ever you stay open like that. yeah like, that's my alarm for my food yeah. but yeah I mean is there pro for you in May I'll definitely be there just for well, sure I'm gonna be there at the Olympia at Arnold gonna be scream you're gonna meet you're gonna hear me scream yalla because no one yalla. speaks arabic here so you're gonna know oh that's tiffany <laughs> i'm excited thank you so yeah. much for this workout and yeah, i hope you for sure i will okay guys i hope you enjoyed this video um another training video i know i suck um more <laughs> more content to come i love you guys so much i'll see you guys in the next one bye